Well, hello there folks, David your friendly Harry Scotsman here once again to do another wee food review this time. Well, I was up in Asda yesterday um, and I found that Chinese style meal for one, chicken curry, vegetable rice and spicy chips. Um, let's see how much this was. It was £3.25, but it was reduced to £1.66. So, £1.66, you really can't go wrong with that, can you? Let's get a wee thingy there. Right there, there we go. Oh, that's about right there. So let's open this thing up. Nice wee box. Oh, it's quite interesting. We have some spicy chips. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten of them. That could be interesting. Mm, the smell of it's good anyway. You got the curry on one side, and you got the rice on the other side. Now let's see what the cooking instructions are. Oh, else I'll put my reading glasses on, and not my seeing ones. Right, da, 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 da. microwave for three minutes. Remove sleeve and pierce film in several places over both compartments. Place directly into microwave and heat on full power for two and a half minutes on that. Uh, two minutes on level 900, which I've got. Peel back the film lid, stir well, return for a further minute. Uh, oh, it says I have to oven heat the chips. Well, that makes no sense, does it? Microwave part of it and cook part of it for 15 minutes. Well... I won't be doing that. I'm going to bung everything in the microwave. Yes, I am a rule breaker as well. So, uh, two minutes with that. So to pierce the lid, what I usually do actually is I tear the corner, I just tweak the corner up a wee bit like that. And the same with that one. We've got on this side and a wee bit on that side and then when it comes to actually taking it all off at the end you can just get a wee flick the steam goes out you don't burn yourself so that actually looks quite nice there's peas carrot same with the rice looks quite fluffy that looks not too bad so with you guys it'll be about that long just going to pop off to the microwave so about I reckon about five minutes of my time, and I'll be back. See you in a sec. If I press the right button. Okay then, so, there is what it looks like. Right in the right way, there we go. Looks not too bad, eh? Just tilt his back up again. Oh, that's scary. And, there we go. Now, it's got, let's have a look here. Right, there is a load of curry, chicken curry with it. Um, it's curry with chicken, it's got peas in it. The rice is quite fluffy, it's got sort of like st stripped bits of carrot and peas and the rice. And the chips, well, as I said, wasn't putting them in the oven for 15 minutes. Bunged them in the microwave for a minute and a half. And, well, they're microwave chips. Quite thick ones. Some thinner ones there as well. Let's try a wee bit of the rice. Get some carrot and pea on it as well. There we go. Let's see what this tastes like. Oh, 
Um, not a lot of taste to that. Let's see what the curry sauce tastes like. It's very sweet. It's not too bad. Tasted a lot worse than a, a microwave meal. Wee bit of chicken, let's see what that tastes like. It's alright. A bit spongy. It's like a typical microwave chicken. Let's try one of these chips. They're not supposed to be spicy. Spicy chips. Um, I don't taste any spice on it, we'll put it that way. Let's try a little bit of everything together, shall we? Mix up the curry and the rice. Like that. Let's try that. I felt a tiny little bit of spice on the side of my tongue there. Um, as I said, it's not the spiciest I've ever had. Not even close, to be honest. It's okay. I mean, for £1.66, it'll fill a gap. Admittedly, not a very big gap. Let's try a bit of more of everything. Um, for a mass produced curry, it's okay. It's, a Ch it's supposed to be a Chinese curry. <coughs> I usually find the Chinese curries have got quite a bit of taste to them. I can, after my second sort of mouthful there, I can actually, I can feel it starting to warm up. It's a grower. Um, it's not ultra hot. It's not ultra spicy. It's a very mild curry. Would I have one again? At full price? Probably not. With the magical yellow sticker label on it. Yeah, I might actually. It's not bad. I mean, you've got some big lumps of chicken there. Oh, it's got a chip underneath it as well, by the way. It's quite a nice colour to it. It's not bad. Try a couple of curried peas. Yeah, the curried peas. That's actually it's not bad. I've tasted. I have tasted so much worse in my time. Just get a plate a forkful here. We've got peas, carrots, rice, curry sauce and chicken. The chicken's soft. It's not chewy. Um, the chips... They're not bog standard. You can taste the something there. But again, once again, very mild. Um, the curry is a, a grower. It's not hot by any stretch, but it's got like a nice little, like a wee tingle on your tongue. I would say not really, really spicy, but just, it's nice. I'd say it was above a korma in Indian. There's more spice than that. The korma's a lot creamier. Um, 
that is more of a, ch a Chinese curry. It's got the wee bit. You can taste like the peppers in it. The, well, not the pepper, the pepper in it. Um, yeah, for one pound sixty-six, can't go wrong. Unless you don't like curry, um, or chicken, or rice, or peas, or carrots, or chips. Most folk that I know do like them. Uh, well, I don't think Kelly likes them. I'm sure she said she didn't like peas. <coughs> um, but yeah, it's not bad. The chicken, you just put your fork through it, it's that soft. There's a bit of resistance there, I mean, you can see me pushing against it, but that's going against the grain. And it is chicken, it is actually chicken meat. It's not sort of that reprogrammed re stuff, you know, where they chop it up and all that. And you can, you can actually see the strands in there in the chicken. It is whole lumps of chicken, which ain't too bad. Let's have another bite. Yeah, I'm quite enjoying this. It's not bad at all. For something that came out of the cooler, the chiller, it wasn't frozen. Um, it was reduced. Say it's a meal for one. It's definitely not a meal for one, it's a snack for one. Um, but that's quite tasty. Yeah, I would have one again. So, Chinese style meal for one, great taste without the guilt. Um, I don't know what's in it. Per pack, 374 calories. That's alright. Um, four grams of fat. 56 grams of carbohydrates. 1.8 grams of fibre, 28 grams of protein, and 1.5 gram of salt. There's water, cooked chicken breast, more chicken breast, corn flour, onions, coconut milk, <coughs> coconut extract, water, peas, 4% of it's peas, garlic puree, ginger puree, chicken bouillon, which is basically just chicken stock. More water. There's a lot of water in this. Yeast, salt, or yeast extract. Yeast extract. That could be marmite. Mmm. Uh, corn flour, dark soy, uh, colourings, plain and caramel, sugar, soya beans, wheat, flour, salt, alcohol. Alcohol, sugar, spices, tapioca starch, tomato paste, and salt. And the rice, vegetable rice, is water, long grain rice, peas, carrots, cauliflower. I haven't found any cauliflower yet. Um, spicy chips, believe it or not. Are potatoes, rapeseed oil, salt, and spices. Hmm. And the box and the trays are 100% recyclable. Yay for the environment! It's actually quite a nice box. <coughs> so, overall, yes, I'd have it again. Not at full price. Um, would I say for other folks to get it? Yeah, give it a go. It's lovely. Well, I wouldn't go lovely, but it's, it's nice. It's tasty. It's got a wee bit of flavour about it. Um, yeah. Go for it. So, on that, I would rather be mix up, get some peas and some carrots and some chicken and some curry, and I will see you all again soon, hopefully. How can I miss a mouth that size? So take care of yourselves. If you like what I do, I'd appreciate it if you hit the button. I think it's either down there or down there. Um, 
I've just broke the 700. I'm really grateful to everyone that subscribed to me. Um, must be doing something right. Very slow growth, but we're getting there. Nice little family of folk here. So, once again, take care everyone, and I'll talk to you all soon when I go and finish this. See ya. If I hit that button right again.